Hi, I'm Andy Teach, host of Andy's Awesome Adventures, and welcome to Split Croatia. So last night we checked into this beautiful hotel, the Santa Lucia, and you can hear the Italian influence there, as part of our Adventures Croatia tour. Really nice hotel, and you can see we're in the square, but you know, we check in, you can see all the outside dining, a lot of people watching, and I don't think a lot of people realize the history that's in this square. So I'm going to tell you briefly about it. This is called People Square or Piazza Square. Again, the Italian influence. And this is a 15th century square. So I'm going to point out two or three of the buildings here that are important and the unique clock. Now, before we explore the history and architecture of People Square, I'd like to thank Adventurous Croatia for sponsoring this video and all of my Croatia videos as I travel around Croatia with them. Adventures Croatia is the leading tour operator specializing in travel to Croatia and surrounding countries. They cater to American tourists and are rated five stars on both TripAdvisor and Trustpilot. You can go to their website, adventurescroatia.com for more information. There's a link to the website in the video description. If you mention my promo code, Andy's Awesome 10, when speaking with Adventures Croatia, you'll get 10% off any trip you book with them. So we're gonna start with this building right across from the hotel. It's the Old City Hall. How do I know it's the Old City Hall? Because the sign says, Old City Hall. Now over here, it's a nice stonework in this building. Looks like a coat of arms, a very old one. But I believe it's this building in the corner is Combri Palace, a 15th century palace. Over here we go to the famous clock. This is a very unique clock. Why? There were 24 digits instead of 12. Roman numerals. Because this town, Split, has a lot of ancient Roman influence. And I didn't realize the ancient Romans were gonna to visit today, but here they are. And it's just another European country that had been invaded by the ancient Romans. But as you can see, this is a bustling square. Lots of outdoor restaurants, lots of people watching. And it's like it's all over the city. Very cool. It looks like a palace. I'm not sure what this building is, but I will find out. And you can see like the gold uh, ornaments, ornamentation at the top here, very nice. So again, this is People Square, or Piazza Square. It's small, but a lot of history behind it. 